Hello friends, today we are going to see how to clone a linked list with random pointers. So let's see, this is the original linked list and every node of this linked list contains data, a random pointer and a next pointer. This random pointer can point to any node in the linked list. So if you want to duplicate this linked list or copy this linked list, then how to manipulate the pointers and how to replicate the pointers. So I will tell you the steps now. So the first step is just create an another linked list with the same data. So now we have assigned the memory, we have created the nodes here and I will assign the data now. So the first node is A, then B, C, D and E. Now our linked list with the next pointer and the random pointer is ready. But the random pointer in this linked list holds null. It does not hold any address because still we have not assigned any address to this random pointer. Now for assigning the address to this random pointer, we have to follow some steps so that we can know the respective nodes in the original linked list hold which addresses for the random pointers. So let's follow. Now first step is point all the next pointers to the respective nodes. So this is the original linked list and the node A, next pointer of node A will point to node A of the copied linked lists. This is the copied linked list. Same for B. C uh, I'm sorry so D and E so we have uh, given the respective nodes address to the next pointer in original linked list so the next step is now for all the random pointers give addresses of the respective nodes in the original linked list. So for all the random pointers in the copied linked list give address of respective nodes in the original linked list. So R will hold the address of node A. This R for B will hold the address of B then it will hold the address of C, this will hold the address of D and this will hold the address of E. Now the third step which is the most important step here deals with this line. So this is our third step C. Now for each node in the clone link list that is this linked list. This is also called as cloned linked lists. So for each node that is clone points R means the random pointer of each node will hold this address. So this address will be assigned to random pointer of each node in the clone linked list. So what is this address? So let's see for each node. For example, for node A, so what address is given by this line, we will see. Clone points R means the address held by this R. So this address is of this node. Then the next points R, so again this address, so this address is of this node points next. So the next pointer of this node holds the address of 
this node that is C. Now you can look that in the original linked list the random pointer was pointing to C and here also we have made our random pointer to point to C by assigning this address to the random pointer of clone linked list. So now this pointer will point to C. If you have seen my previous linked list videos then you can assign you can understand this address assignment. So similarly for B the random pointer holds the address of this node and this random pointer holds the address of A and the next pointer holds the address of A in the copied link list. So this random pointer will hold the address of A in the copied link list. So similarly this random pointer will hold the address of E in the copied link list. Again this random pointer will hold the address of obviously C. So it will hold the address of C and this random pointer will hold the address of D. So this is how we copy the random pointers in the clone linked list. We will see an another approach in my next video to copy the random pointers. Hey friends, please subscribe to my channel as I post algorithm videos every day. And if you want a video on any particular topic, then please mention in the comment below. Thank you.